day 237-2023. Today I had my usual work day and I was a little busy too. Luckily, I work indoor and I didn't need to go out because it was very, very hot today. It's over 100 degrees. I can't imagine for those people who have to work outdoors. So if you have to work outdoors in the next couple of days, please stay safe if you are in the area with extreme heat. And we were just back from the Southern Asia and in most places in South, Southern Asia in summer, they experience this type of heat almost every day. Of course, when we, we were traveling, when it was too hot, we could just uh, stay indoors to, to enjoy the uh, air conditioning as much as we could. So we tried to avoid staying outdoors too much. However, the people in those places seem to be used to that type of heat. That also tells me that no matter how hard the this, this situation is, how hard the condition is, when we are exposed to it more and more, we will build our resilience, we will build our strength to deal with it. Of course, hopefully we don't have to have this type of extreme heat. Based on the forecast, it will only last uh, another couple of days. So hopefully it will cool down significantly soon. Also, after work, we went to my husband's ex-wife's house for another party to welcome her nephew, who hasn't met with many of the family members in a long time. And uh, it was my first time to meet with him. When we were there and my husband's ex-wife made a comment said if you want to know what's going on in our lives you better be friend with Mushan. I thought that's funny because from that comment you can tell we have very open and harmonious and loving and close relationship in the family and I'm very grateful for the people around me and for the family. Anyway, see you tomorrow.